When I told you I was a bull, you were uneasy. You said you didn't approve of what I was doing over there in Spain, so I bought you a matador suit, wrapped it in crude skeletal poems, haiku scrawled on everything I could get my hooves on, receipts, napkins, dollar bills, ticket stubs, swatches of my own leather. I hope you had one hell of a time unveiling your red cape. The banderillas pinned to the rappels, I made those myself. I stole Cupid's best arrowheads and whittled down a couple of gods into olive trees, into shafts with my horns. I only made a few because you're such a good shot. Perfectionist, there will be a lot of blood, and you're going to pollock the walls with it. I can already tell. The Colosseum erupts as you party game that first barb into my back. A group of calves can be heard sobbing quietly in the distance. This is our first song. Thousands of cheering strangers, house band, dusty pit, dance floor, sweltering drum solo, spotlight. I'm sorry, I'm no good at this waltz. I have four left feet. I look up at you, your Tahe de Luce glistening like the blood-stained apron of a butcher. You ask if I am okay, batting your eyelashes like sharpening a cleaver. I mutter, yes, dear, just counting the steps. Lover, when the music ends, will you bring me to bed and bandage me with your body? Or will you kneel beside me and stick a knife between my ribs like an artist signing her work? It must be the latter, because here I am, halfway to hung over your fireplace. Ole, I am pooling around my split seams. The earth refuses to lap me up. Ole, why do you treat this like a misery I need to be put out of? Ole, your love is a whole lot like a lightning bolt. All hot and hurt, it's there right before it isn't. Ole, matador translates to killer. I should have known how you let your work consume you, Ole. I was a bull to you, but never a human being. Ole, the jewels on my head make me king of what did you expect? All I tried to do was crown you the queen of bear with me. Ole, these titles are as empty as your suit might as well be when you you shout into a cave and are not given an echo. What are you supposed to think? Ole, I am a flesh and muscle china shop. Ole, you can't be this reckless without breaking a few plates. Ole, thank you for this ink and this quill. It is so hard scratching poems in this dust with these cumbersome horns. At least now I can write proper. When the stadium empties out, I remove the blade from between my ribs, my chest a spigot, draining the many ink wells you embedded in me and write to the matador. I am holding on. I am still learning to budget my inspiration. I was writing so much, I started to bleed out, but I am still breathing. I enjoyed our dance very much. I was wondering if in the future, you think you might be interested in coming back up on this stage, because for you, I know, I've still got a few dances in these tired hooves. I am holding on to your knife in the hopes that you'll return for it, but you carry a whole lot of nope under your tongue, a whole lot of scared, a whole lot of raindrop. I love you in this dust. This desert is so hot. You send your spit up to heaven whenever you open your mouth. You deal like dehydration like a shark. You just shut up and bite. I do not know how to reach you. I do not know how to reach you. I do not know how to reach you. I am a runaway 18-wheeler of love. Watching myself hurtle down this apology with shot breaks. I am clear-cutting this highway. I'm just one big axe with a whole lot of swing. And all that's left to do is watch this crash, and Lord, there will be rubberneckers, signed the bull. <laughs>